Some people might think I'm obsessed with sanders. I don't think that's the case, but I just hate sanding by hand. And that drives me to make some contraptions to help me avoid that part. The disc for the tower was cut on the circuit cutting jig with the band saw. And the smallest one I got with the hole saw. I'm not going to bore you with a lot of cutting, drilling and shaping of different parts. Just a small overview. The shelves get some additional support to help keep them rigid. Seatings for the bearings are drilled in the top and bottom. I made some extra support for the tables on the other side. As I have access to a metal lathe at work, I decided to make another 5mm spindle on top. This is not included in the available plans unless you want to add it. The second smallest spindle is made from a plastic hose. I had to heat it in warm water to get it to slide onto the threaded rod. The plastic hose was scuffed using some sandpaper to get the glue to stick a little better. I had to cut a nut in half to make sure it did not protrude above the top table and interfere with the top spindle. This is not necessary unless you want to add this extra feature. To true up the drums, I attached it temporarily and turned them with a lathe tool. Cut the cloth back abrasive to length and I try to cut it at an angle. This will most likely help the sandpaper not to get caught in the workpiece. The abrasive is attached with spray adhesive. Assembly of the sander is pretty straightforward. The power drill is held in place by a plywood clamp. Securing the cables and connecting the on-off switch. Sander could be made into a bench model by attaching a base plate.
but I chose to put mine on the wall in the French fleet. Notice the vent holes in the drill cover to allow for good circulation of air. Choose the spindle diameter you want to use and remove the shelves that might block your view. I made a pipe that holds the shelf removable to be able to easily remove the shelves if I wanted full access to all the spindles and for freehand shaping. 